Let's go Hufflepuff fans. We're taking down Ashley today. She's going down 0 for 2. Let's go. 1 for 1. I'm confident today. We'll see about that. What's up, peeps? Got another one. The dealer's choice. So if you haven't seen the last video, Ashley went into the cabinet of magnificence and chose three whiskeys. They could be a bourbon, scotch, and rye, or Irish, any of the above. So she chose three whiskeys, and the order that she chose them out of the cabinet from the intro is the order that she thinks my palate's gonna prefer. So the first one she drew out, she thinks is gonna be my best, or my favorite. All right, getting into the first one, I want to say this is a bourbon whiskey. I'm getting a little dill out of it, like a dill pickle. Some sweetness. You got your brown sugar and your vanilla. Ooh, that's a solid bourbon. You get the the dill pickle actually follows through on the palate a little bit, but then it finishes off as a clean bourbon, your brown sugar, your vanillas. That's a solid bourbon. Getting into the next one. You got, <laughs> this one reminds me of the s'mores from the Texas whiskeys. You got your dark chocolate. You got your charred marshmallow. Bubbles, you know. You hold it over the fire, it creates bubbles, and then it gets a little char on it. Most people are stupid. You're gonna start fighting. <laughs> that is a complex whiskey. That one hits first place. Getting into the third one. Whew. I'm getting quite a bit of banana. Maybe a little like sea saltness. Some deep dark fruit. You got your classic bourbon, brown sugar, vanillas. So I, I'm pretty sure this is a bourbon. <clears throat> Based on the color, I think that one was a malt. And as I said before, I think that one's a bourbon. This one has a lot more complexities than this one on the nose. I think this is the order I want to go with. This one just had so much complexity to it. Like the fact that the smell of this can come out of a barrel just blows my mind. This one smells really good, but it's nothing compared to that. Those two are pretty comparable but I think I'll keep it like that. Okay. Was this one of the Texas whiskey ones? Really? Really. What? Mm -hmm. No. Mm -hmm. It's definitely a malt. Is it a malt? Mm -hmm. That was an Irish? Yeah. What? Mm-hmm. What was that? Do you want me to show you? In a moment. Bourbon? Mm-hmm. Bourbon. Mm-hmm. Fuck. You ready? Yeah. Hit me in the tank. No! <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. Uh, that was just one of Okay, that was one of them. Alright, 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 alright. Dick. This was the Irish. Was it really? That one? Mm-hmm. 
All right, I saw the whiskeys that Ashley brought out and it kind of opened my eyes to uh, what I was missing out of these whiskeys. So Ashley, what was number three? Third place, number Bravo. Oh, Remus Repeal Reserve. I think this is series five. Straight bourbon whiskey, sitting at 50% ABV. This is an MGP whiskey. It got third place. All right, Ashley. We got a barrel finish, a Kentucky straight bourbon finish, Woodford reserved, finished in another oak. This one's sitting at 45.2%. And this one surprised the hell out of me when she took it out of the cabinet because a lot of these notes I didn't really get before, but smelling it now, I'm getting a whole new world. First place, Redbreast 12 Cask rain sitting at 57.6 percent abv i'm excited to look back at this video and see exactly what i was tasting blind because whenever i taste red breast and i know it's red breast i get a lot of butter cookie and some other classic irish notes but this one <sighs> That one blew my mind. I got s'mores and dark chocolate and went above and beyond my love for red breast. I love red breast, but this just took it to a whole new level. Ashley, what was the order that you thought I was gonna choose? The red breast, then the remix, and then the Woodford Wizard. Wow, I would say you're one and one. May the roof above us never fall in, and we friends beneath never fall out. Cheers. That is a complex whisk whiskey. <clears throat> Grab it! Thanks.